Okay, so I wanted to come really quick. Um, I've been working on an app and I've been trying to find ways to use Firebase um, to load profiles and to set up profiles. And um, I, I just wanted to come really quickly. It's pretty late right now, but to show you guys how I created this profile, I'm just gonna sign in really quick so you guys can see um what it is so i just have a dummy um account here oops this is like i said it's, it's almost like two o'clock but um i just want to show you guys what i came up with because i had issues finding things like this so basically this is a login and this use this is using firebase on the back end um to authenticate users. So I already have a user signed up, which is me, um, and basically create a profile page. And here I just have like a background, which is the same as a sign in. Um, you can also have like photos down here or whatever you want. Um, this is just, I feel like the, the pieces that were important to me and, you know, working around those things. So, let me just log back in. I'm test.com. And you can put your own things on here, but I tried to hurry up as far as password. I, I really don't care about it being private. Um, and what you can do is you can actually click on this, and, and my computer is really slow, so it'll bring up our camera roll. Say I want to change the picture. I want to be more anonymous and have leaves and things like that. So I choose that. Um, I hit save. It doesn't go away or anything like that now, but you can definitely program that stuff. That stuff wasn't as important as learning this. So if we log out and then we log back in, the safest password ever. Trust me, everyone should turn, you know, do their password this way. You see that it saves the image. Um, I'll show you guys the database. This is my database. So I just have the one user, um, the image, which is going to be using Firebase storage and username. So I'm not going to set up, I'm not going to show creating this in set up the firebase um firebase and google does do a really great job of showing that and that's one thing i didn't have an issue with so i would say if you're having issues with firebase um go to firebase at google.com and they have tons of videos and setting it up has, was definitely not one of the issues that i had so i won't go through this but if you want to see how I'm basically saving images to Firebase um, and then loading those back, saving the user information and loading those back, creating a profile. This could be something like, um, I think all, I, I, I can't think of an app that I would create right now that wouldn't have a, a user profile. So I feel like this, I want to be as helpful as possible with this. So like I said, stay tuned if you want to see how I set this up. I like to set up my storyboard first because I like to know exactly what I'll be looking at. And I probably should bring that back. I'm so silly. Um, I know I have two view controllers. One is for the login and then the other is for the profile. So the login, um, all I used was an image view for that background. So I'm just going to stretch this out. There we go. There we go. 
Okay. Um, I have images. Well, no, I don't. Um, I need images to load onto my board. So I like to stay pretty neat when I create things. Um, so maybe let me supporting files. And I know you probably use different other things for that, but right now this is how I'm going to do it. I just, I just really need to just get some documents up here. Um, and let's see, do we have, I got this image from, um, let's see, from unsplash.com. So, in case you guys are wondering, this is from Unsplash by Scott Webb. That was really awesome. So, yeah. It's really cool image, I think. I love these kind of fish eye image or fish. I think it's called fish eye. So, I'm just going to change that to this. Okay. Um, so... <clears throat> I'm going to use aspect fill um, just to kind of cover the whole thing. Now, I did have um, a blur or um, a gradient on it. Not gradient, but more so a blur or dark kind of overcast for it. There's tons of ways to do that. You can do it in a blur. Um, this isn't a tutorial for that. So I'm just going to make it pretty simple on myself. Let me actually set this up so that we sh this scales. There we go. And then I'm just going to add this. And like I said, you can, I, this isn't a design tutorial, but I like things to look good because I know when I'm looking for something, I want something where it looks good because it helps me get ideas. And this is gonna be the same for all it, auto resizing. Um, it helps me get ideas. It helps me, it helps motivate me and things like that. So some of this stuff would be super, uh, you guys know how to do this stuff. Let's say 75. I think I probably went 50 on mine. I can't remember exactly, but let's just 2.7. I think that's good. We just want it to be dark. Um, let's hurry up and add our text field just for our sign in. Okay, and you can do logos and all that really cool stuff. So I'm just going to place the text field here. Um, and let's do placeholder text of uh, username. And we're going to do our auto layout stuff. Uh, a trick that I learned is when you want to duplicate, because we have three cells here, hit the Alt key and then just drag down. We're going to have another one. So we have one that says, so basically I'm just copying three text fields there. Um, placeholders, the email and password. Like I said, clear text. I'm, this is not a design thing or a security themed thing. It's just basically, um, just to show you guys and to really reinforce what I've learned myself. So that way I don't have to sit there and, and you know, spend so much time on Google and, and YouTube next time. Um, they always say the best way to learn something is by teaching it. So that's kind of what I'm trying to do here. Um, you guys are probably, if you guys are here, you, you guys are probably as frustrated as I was when I tried to find um, some really cool or, or some ways to do this. And you came up empty handed or you had to piece together different things um, I think it was, this was, I think it was sign up, um, 
sign up. Which it probably should be. It should probably be log in here. This should be sign up. And this may be a little bit different than I had in the um, preview, but I figured that what will probably be easier because I do want to do these and I, I want to do them more frequently. Um, but I think what probably would be helpful is if I Hmm. just did them first and then recorded the, the session thing. But I'm going to try to do this as closely as possible to what I have up there. Um, so let me make sure that this is... Okay, so it's recorded. I just want to make sure because the last thing I want is to not be recording and have done all this because I would give up. I would completely cut everything off um, and that'll be it. And you know what? I know I said this wasn't a design thing, but you know, let's do the same thing for here. Okay. So that's the end, um, of the setup. I'm going to upload another video with the second part. I was going to cut this out but I figured that you guys would probably like to see it. So anyway, stay tuned, watch the next videos, and it'll get into more detail. Thanks.